And Ignis didn't even get any of that experience. Poor guy. And now... The Tomb of the Pious. Now we get our first unrequired weapon. Which looks like a lance. And thus the arsenal builds once more. So, what do we have this time? Center of the Pious. Yeah, almost makes up for the soaked socks and bug bites. <laughs> I guess spinning a yarn, how ironically appropriate. Now I just gotta head back to Cave Kayam again. Can we just jump from right here? No? Okay, then we'll do the next best thing. And we can't even do that. Okay, this is gonna be a long trip back. Oh, no, hold on. There we go. Return to entrance. Ooh, and that was actually a pretty quick one. Consider me impressed. Alright, now we should be able to return to car. Back to Cape Kyan. All right, move out. Yeah. While that's going on, I'm gonna tell you of the time we've been gone for so far because it feels like it's been a while, actually. Hour and ten minutes. So not as long as I think. Cars. Excited to visit Altisha or what? I guess. I'm so jealous. We're not going on vacation. Oh, yeah. You're right. There is? Something wrong? What? No, I'm fine. I I'm not jealous. I just had a lot of fun hanging out with you guys. But that'll all be in the past once we hit Kayam. What are you talking about? We can hang out anytime, right? Yeah, absolutely. After all, when it comes to friends, five's never a crowd. Now if it's a date, maybe. A double date specifically, in our case. Or would it be a quadruple date? Because four of us. Well, unless you're what dating what well, never mind. Why am I getting into this? Let's pull over for a sec. How come? Well, I gotta give the driver a break every now and then. He, he just took a so. break. Wonder why no one ever thought of that before. Because no one ever had a little sister along for the ride. Wait, we literally just took a break. Do we need to take another one? So quick. Uh. Sure. <clears throat> that was a tight squeeze. Sorry for cramping your style. Calm down. I'm just kidding. Not my fault you're too big for the back seat. Oh. Sounds like Lady Luna Freya is staying in Altitia. Is it safe for her there? I mean, Accordo is Imperial territory. See, for a second there, I thought that, you know, uh, this woman behind this woman was, uh, Ravis for some reason. I don't know why. I just freaked out there for a minor second there. Yeah, we'll just you know, talk to these guys. What about the Imperial base? Yeah, some Lucians went in and raised hell. They raised hell, all right. Put the base commander in the hospital. 
Yeah. Uh, if only we could have killed him. All right, back to Cape Kaim. Let's hit it again. Sure. How much longer? <laughs> One like mile, huh? Salt in the air. Sea breeze. We're on the water. Wow. It's beautiful. Picture perfect. Prompto! Come on, but dude! You literally said picture perfect. How's that not a trigger word for you? Hey. I guess the photographist knows Go better than we do. This beautiful view. Yeah, like something out of a dream. Just don't fall asleep on me. No, we won't. We can't. We gotta keep our heads focused. Because we got 0.70 miles before we reach the uh, Cape Cayenne. I don't know why I keep forgetting the name. It's right there in the corner of the map. Maybe I'm just still wow. rocky. Look at that bridge up ahead. <laughs> Some piece of work right there. The rivers run wide out here, so the bridges run long. Guess I'll see it when we cross. Now watch, somebody's gonna come and hit the bridge and we're gonna fall into the water. I, I predict it right now. Want to get a closer look? Take back my yeah, previous what? comments. At the bridge? Sure. We made it. I swear, this is the most pissed off we've ever taken in one single uh, route. Is there a uh, photography spot I'm not aware of? Doesn't seem that way. So, what did we get out here for? I'm a little bit confused. Ba -da -ba -ba. All right, move out. Yeah. <sighs> so, you're the one doing all the cooking. Ooh, 13. Oh, Gladdy, don't you help? Uh, Grab the supplies. Knocked. Uh, on occasion. What occasion? I do my part. I always set the table. That's some arrangement you guys have here. It is kind of sad when you think about it. But hey, it's his personal skill. Is this the place? Sure is. Thanks for the lift, Ignis. My pleasure. <sighs> Can't wait to see my buddy talking. Just 150 Whoa, feet. Pretty impressive lighthouse. What say we, we head on up? Ought to be a nice view, if a bit blocked. What's up? If it's it Cindy. All. Recognize the purr of that engine anywhere. Whew. You know your stuff. Part of that Iris's company? Alas, looks like we've got no toys. Thanks for the ride. It was fun. Yeah, absolutely. Gonna miss you. Papa's tinkering away. Reckon he'll be tinkering for some time. Trouble at sea. Seen her share by the looks of her. Some parts we can fix, others need replacing. An overhaul. Don't y'all worry. Papa ain't going nowhere till the job's done. Parts won't fetch themselves, though. Was kind of hoping y'all wouldn't mind helping out with that. We're at your disposal. What you need? To tell the truth, we already got a couple hands on deck. Dustin and Monica. Those two have been real swell. Managed to gather just about everything we need. You can depend on the Crown's Guard. Trouble is, they ain't had much luck finding a certain something by the name of Mithril. Ooh! Apparently the stuff's hard to come by around these parts. At least according to the little fella from the city. Talcott? You betcha. 
Sharp as a tack, that one. Could tell y'all more about the stuff than I could. I'll be sure to ask. I had to get a quick little dose of uh, dinner there. Yeah, there's not much else reason for me to cut. Anyway, Pop Cindy. down on the dock. Now, if y'all excuse me, I'm gonna grab my tools and ski daddle. Got a garage to look after. Christ! Right. this! Hey! Duck it! Our house is over here. Right this way. Coming on over. Let's go! Woo 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 woo! I think Miss Cindy might have told you already, but she needs a very special kind of ore called Mithril to fix the bow. Remember the waterfall? I read in Grandpa's notebook, there's some ruins near a lake just north of there. It said you'll find Mithril inside! Perfect! Didn't mean know what to do. Oh, of course we got this box of that. Speak to about Iris. that lake. Pretty sure he was talking about the Vesper Pool. I asked Monica to look into it, and she told me the road leading there's under Imperial lockdown. You'll want to be prepared for anything. So, how's that coming along? Once you proceed, you'll be unable to return for some time. I'm conflicted right now. How long is this gonna take? I mean, I guess I could save automatically, but at the same time, maybe not. Is there any wish to continue? Hold on, just in case. Well, let's go in here. I want to see. Come on. Let's do a little exploring. Before we uh, get on our way. Hmm, pretty decent. I like it. Kind of reminds me of the house boats my family used to run. Ooh, and I see for item. Item, 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 item. Gimme, 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 gimme. Orgalia Crest. Oh, we cannot... For no cost at all. In that case, yes. I would love to... Uh, you know. Let's call it a day. Soft beds, baby. <laughs> Let that experience tally up. Just enough for all of us. And the final tally for the session is... Level 30 for us, level 28 for Gladiolus and Prompto, and Ignis falling behind at level 27. Again, kind of sad, because Prompto, as far as I'm aware, has always been the glass cannon of the group. Ooh, but his photography level is not getting too shabby. can barely see her in there. <laughs> Definitely keep that one. <laughs> Not bad. That is a creepy ass smile, I'm just saying. You got me uh, you got a photo of me talking to these two. I I don't even know how to respond to that. Alright, so everything is saving. <sighs> oh, Appropriate. And then we just exit out. Like so. Oh. Uh, oh, there's the door. Knock this. Can't see doors. Alright. I think that'll do it for the... And next time, we'll go find ourselves some Mithril. Because that will be a fun time. Maybe. But either way, guys, that's going to do it for this session of Final Fantasy XV. If you guys have enjoyed, of course, as always, make sure to leave a like and comment down below. 
share this video with your friends, should you feel the need to, and of course if you are new here to the channel, let's see more Final Fantasy XV as it comes out daily, along with every series I decide to throw into the mixer, then by all means make sure you have subscribed and join the Dren Knights and Noctis and his crew in our quest to obtain some Mithril for the ships so that uh, Talcott and Iris here can, you know, head to Kayim, where they'll hopefully be safe from the Empire. Maybe. Something tells me a plot twist is going to come in after we do this. Uh, but hey, until next time, this is Mind of Four signing out. Have a great your day, take care, and I hope to see you guys tomorrow with some more Final Fantasy XV.